Hey YouTube! Welcome back to my channel. Am I standing up? Yes, I'm standing up, but I am here to bring you a quick little video on these brand new, what are y'all, what the frig are these called? Rouge Signature Lightweight Matte Colored Ink. Sorry, the reason I had to look at it is because the name is so damn long. Like, why you gotta be so long, L'Oreal? Why you gotta be so long? I have mine in the colors I Create 416, as well as I Am Worth It which is a 426. One is like a My Lips But Better nude shade, the other one is like a classic blue-toned red. Now, I bought these because I was like, you know what, these look sleek as hell in the packaging. They look like almost little pens. And to be honest, they're $11.99. It's pretty pricey for the drugstore, but I love the little like frosted plastic bottle. And I was like, you know what, these are going to be better than the Maybelline Super Stay Matte inks, which stay on your lips like nobody's beeswax. They will stay on forever. So I was super excited to try these because I was like, that Maybelline Super Stay Matte ink formula is pretty uncomfortable, but I'm obsessed with it for the longevity of it. So you know what I'm gonna do? These are gonna be a more comfortable, airy feeling, super stay matte ink. And was I right? No, no, I was not right at all. In fact, they are more comfortable. I did hit it out of the park with that, I will give it, but these wear off on me personally so much faster. And to be honest, on me, they never really dry down to the point where they're non-transferable. I love how thin they are. I love the little angle-ended doe foot. Um, so this is I Create and I Am Worth It. And the formula is like very thin and beautiful. I Am Worth It is a little more fuchsia tone than I was hoping for. And this barely shows up on my lips. I guess that's why it's called My Lips But Better, but really it makes no difference on my lips whatsoever. They're not budge proof in my opinion. I felt like they were going all over the place. I felt like this red one feathered outside the lines a little bit. So I feel like a lot of people might be looking at these for the longevity that the matte, the Maybelline matte Super Stay inks are, but these rouge inks, these, what are they called? These rouge signature lightweight matte colored inks don't have that longevity, in my opinion. The colors are really pretty, and in my opinion, they just never really dry down to a point where they're non-transferable. And they do the annoying wear away on me in the center of my lips. So I was hoping this was the answer to my prayers and they were going to replace the longevity of the Super Stay Matte inks. But in my opinion, stick with matte inks. These are much more comfortable, yes, but they're gonna be on your lips for a lot less time. They are, like I said, this color doesn't show up at all. So this is just a quick video. I just wanted to get the message out there. If you are looking at them for that reason, they are really pretty, they are really comfortable, just not my faves. So in terms of favor save, I would save, get the Maybelline if you're looking for longevity, but if you are looking for comfort, these are pretty, as long as you don't mind not having them on for a long amount of time. There's 12 shades, they're on, I got them at Ulta, so, I saw them at CVS too. If you're looking for them, there they are. So that is my opinion on these. The L'Oreal Million Year Long Name Long Rouge Something Inks because I'm never gonna remember that full name. Bottle, A+, plus, longevity, F. <laughs> Thanks so much for watching, guys. Bye.